e shalom one give our praise on and glory to yahoo bashem yahoo shai double honors to the apostles and the elders at gms that taught me the truth and all you brothers in the four corners of the earth yahoo bashem yahoo shai bashem rakak wadash rakathan to your brothers the confusion of faces among all nations and your sisters yahoo bashem yahoo shai bashem rakak wadash rakathan to you all and your families all right the israelites were the so-called latinos the natives and the so-called negroes scattered among every nation all right the name of this lesson is we are messengers all right the men that you see on the highways and edges in the four corners of the earth we are just messengers we are just messengers of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. The Lord didn't give us some weapon or anything to go and kill anybody. The Lord sent us to deliver a message. And that's to tell Esau and his other nation that they are going into slavery. They're going to pay for everything that they did to the children of Israel and to teach our people that we are the Israelites the elect of our nation all right that's all the Lord sent us to do is to preach this word deliver this message all right the Lord didn't send us out there to pick up guns all right the Lord didn't send us out there to, to, to force this message upon anybody. Yeah, the scriptures say compel them to come in. That's a part of the message. But if they don't want to get it, you, 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 put, you put a gun to, to a JK and tell, yeah, you receive this truth. If you receive this message, you, you're going to die. No. All right. That's not according to scriptures. You know? Let me get my first scripture before I continue. First scripture. First Thessalonians. Second Thessalonians. Because we're just messengers at the end of the day. The scripture tell you that the um, fishes gonna turn into hunters. But we are not in that time right now. That time will come when the fish fishes will turn into hunters. But we are not in that time. This is um Second Thessalonians chapter two. And verse eight. And then shall that wicked be revealed, whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of his mouth. You know, and we are the Lord mouthpiece. Alright? And the wicked is being revealed right now. To the the prophets of the Lord. And this is the time we saw being revealed. Alright. This is um Hosea chapter six verse verse five. Therefore have I yewn them by the prophets I have slain them by the words of my mouth and thy judgment are as the light that goeth forth so that that's a precept to prove that the voice of the Lord's mouth are the prophet all right let me read back second um, Thessalonians chapter 2 of verse 8 and then shall that wicked be revealed whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of his mouth and shall destroy 
with the brightness of his coming. See, in order for see force, the Lord has to consume this man. Alright, with the spirit of his mouth, which is his prophet, which is his word, that his prophet is speaking. Alright, then the Lord will destroy him with the brightness of his coming. I show brothers always hear that the apostles, apostle elder, Taha always say that there is an order to prophecy. There is. Alright, so in order for the um the Lord to destroy this man, alright, if we in that time where the Lord is destroying with the with the destroying him with his mouth, with his prophet. Alright? We ain't in that time or or I should say you know where the, the fishes is becoming hunters. Alright, we in that time where Yahweh Bashim Yahushai is stripping this man naked, showing his sin, showing his wickedness. Alright? And he's doing that by the mouth of his prophets. That's what the Lord sent us out there to do. The Lord didn't send us out there to, 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 to fight anybody, to, you know, to kill anybody. All right? To pull guns on anybody. All right? The Lord sent us out there to preach this word. Regardless if they hear or they, 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 they forbear. Prosecuted for the word, you know. This is Jeremiah chapter. This is Jeremiah chapter 5 and verse 14. Wherefore, thus said the Lord, Yahweh Shai, the power of us, because ye speak this word, behold, I will make my words in thy mouth fire, and this people would. And he shall devour them. You see? The Lord sent us to preach this word. We in that time of preaching this word. You see? This is Romans chapter 12. Romans chapter 12 and verse 19. It said, Dearly beloved, avenge not yourselves, but rather give place unto wrath. For it is written, written, vengeance is mine, I will repay, said the Lord. You know, so how about He is the one that would repay these Eden. We paid two towards our people for what they did to his messengers. Alright? That's not our fight. That's not our job. That's not our concern. Our job is to deliver the message. Alright? And the Lord tell us why is delivering the message. That he would send men with us. The Lord tell us that. You know, so we ain't have to do nothing. We ain't have to get our hands nasty. You see? Psalms 34 verse 7. It said, The angel of the Lord encamp round about them that fear him and deliver them. You know, and this made me remember when, um, in in the book of Genesis, when the three angel, which one of them was Yahushai, went to 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 meet Abraham. You know, and the two men that was beside him. So the Lord sent us brothers to deliver this message, and the angel is right beside us, just in case they they they. These people want to try anything. 
because Israel is known to you know to put the messengers to death but you remember what the prophecy say Akim? the prophecy say the teacher shall no more be removed into a corner you know let me get Isaiah 30 verse 20 and though the Lord give you the bread of adversity and the water of affliction you know all this hell that we catch yet shall not thy teachers be removed into a corner anymore you know because the prophets was taken out of the way by the nation of Israel you know they will kill the prophets they will do whatever they please with the prophets but now Yahweh how shall I say the the prophets the teachers won't be removed into a corner anymore but thine eye shall see thy teachers you see this is the time that Yahweh Shem Yahushai messengers will be heard this is the time this is the time when the messengers of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai will magnify his name you know and the Lord will glorify him glorify his name and glorify his men this is not the time for the ungodly and wicked men you see So this is the time for the Lord to magnify himself. Alright. Let me get um let me get one more precept. Then I will close. Let's start um Yeah. Second Samuel twenty two. And verse 47 Yahweh live it and blessed be my rock and exalted be the power of the rock of my salvation it is power that avenge me and that bring it down the people under me so we are not the ones doing anything Yahweh Bashim Yahusha, he is the one he is the one doing everything you know he wake us up he give us his word he the, the Holy Spirit, you know, that is teaching us what to say. He is the one giving us strength to deliver the message. Everything is Yahweh Hashem Yahusha. You see, so the Lord gonna deliver us through whatever situation is. It's not our place to to threaten. To revive or to do none of that. Our place is to deliver the message. Alright, so with that, I hope this video was a fine to the elect of our nation, the hopefully elect. All praise, honor, and glory due to Yahweh Bashim Shalom.